What is up, y'all? Hope y'all having a wonderful day. We are here in Galway, New Jersey at Sea View. We're gonna be playing the Pines course today. This is gonna be part one in the front nine. Hoping to make a lot of birdies here today, so we're just gonna jump straight into it. Number one, par four, 396. Pretty much just gonna tee it high, let it fly. Down the right side and did hop a little right. I think it's gonna be okay, but we may have a little tree trouble. Not quite the starting drive we're looking for. We have 79 yards left. Little tree trouble. Pin looks to be set back. Got to keep it down below this, but then kind of keep it right and over that next branch there. I'm gonna go with a little flighted lob wedge. From there, we'll take that all day long, middle of the green. All right, in with the par here on one. We're on to number two, par five, 495. Plays pretty straight away, and I don't really see a reason not to hit driver. Tee it high, let it fly. Those first two drives out there a bit right. I uh, saw it down. It's going to be on the edge of those trees. Don't y'all worry. We will find the fairway eventually. We've got 157 left. Looks to be kind of set on the far right there, just over the corner of that bunker. And I definitely need to keep this down below this branch right here and keep it right of the next branch. So I think I'm going to hit a little low cut chippy seven iron. A little short left there, but that was our plan. If I hit it straight, it was gonna be just fine. And if it cut, it may trundle up here close. We've got about maybe 25 yards here. See if we can get this up and down and get a little pin slammer. One in that putt, didn't go in. Even through two, we're on a number three, par three, 196. I'm gonna go with the seven iron. There is a helping breeze here. We're gonna get on track and I've got a good feeling about today's round. Was right at it a little short may have spun back to the fringe here we are very front edge and i cannot believe how much spin we created there is my pitch mark are you kidding me we'll fix that here in a second that seven iron spun about 15 feet we're putting back up the hill here about 40 feet let's roll the rock Level par through three. Number four, par four, 432. Does bend around the corner to the right. So we are gonna be trying to cut that corner a little bit. I think that one could be pretty good. The first two tee shots were just practicing for the fourth tee shot right here. I think that one could be about perfect. 
So I could have cut that another 30 yards and would have been just fine. We've got 87 yards left, slightly down the hill, pretty accessible pin here. And since we are on the cart path, I'm gonna be taking relief right here. For those of you who are new to the game, when your ball is resting on the cart path, you get two clubs. So you get your nearest point of relief, take your stance, make sure you're not standing on the cart path. Then you take two club lengths, no closer to the hole, and then take your drop, no penalty. We got a putt for bird. Let's go. Pin slammer here on four gets us to one under on the day. You absolutely love to see making birdie on the number one handicap hole. The rating here at the Pines course at Sea View is 72.4 with a rating of 123. Number five, par four, 404, bends to the right. I am definitely liking these holes bending to the right since we're flaring everything to the right. So our target aiming point is gonna be there with a little fade. I think that just clipped that tree on the corner. It's gonna be fine. It just kind of dropped down, but needed a little more on it. That is where we hit somewhere up in there. Drop straight down. We've got 147 to what looks to be a middle pin. And we definitely have some tree trouble here. We need to keep it below this branch and let it trundle up through the gap there. I think I'm gonna go a little seven iron. Get her trundling down there. Oh, we needed that to cut a little bit, not draw a little bit. I think that jumped into the left bunker. It did trundle down into the bunker right there. We are pin high, little green to work with. See if we can't get it up and down. Love to see it. Number six, par three, 187. Little help and breeze. I think we're gonna hit a smooth little seven iron here. You do not wanna be short. Looks to be a, kind of a hazard waste area down there. Oh, I hit that one good. I hit it too good. I probably swung too hard there. That's a little long. Walking up backside of the green. Here it is, a little long. Landed like right there, hop forward. Got a lot of green to work with. See if we can't ship it in. That one had a bit too much trundle on it. When the putter shows up, the putter shows up. Gentle pin placement, but we'll take it here on six. We're not hitting it our best today, but the putter is showing up and showing up big. One under through six. Got three holes left here in the front nine. Part one here at the Pines course at Sea View. Part four, 410 yards. Place pretty straight. The green does sit off back slightly to the right back there. I think I'm just gonna take it right of that left bunker with a little fade. I think that might be our first fairway hit today. Let's go. You absolutely love to see it. First fairway hit today, 82 yards left. Let's knock it close. I think
think that should be pretty much pin high right there. That was a little bit of a misread right there. Part here on seven. I want to thank Seaview so much for having me out. This place has been incredible. And if you are in the Galway, New Jersey area, just outside of Atlantic City, would highly recommend here. They've got the Bay Course as well. And then the hotel has been absolutely first class. The staff here, absolutely incredible. Definitely recommend Seaview. Number eight, par four, bends around to the left. I think I'm gonna go with a little stinger around the corner there. a little higher than the stinger we were looking for, but hit well and right down the middle. Absolutely zero trundle right there. 128 left and looks to be somewhat in the middle of the green into the wind. I'm going to go with a flight of gap wedge. Pulled a little bit, hit like a draw there, kind of left side of the green. You hate to see three putt. Back to level par. Final hole here in the front nine, number nine, par five, 526. Unfortunately, I don't think this is a driver hole. There's a hazard that kind of cuts into the fairway there. So we're gonna go three iron, just kind of down the middle. Great, that was a big sweep and draw down the left. I'm not really able to go for this. Green sits off back around the corner. I probably have roughly like 290 left, so I'm gonna go with a five iron here. Just kind of get it out there, middle of the fairway. All right, should have a look into the green from there. All righty. Fairway finder for the layup. Yes, I did say layup. 115 up the hill into the wind. I'm actually going to go with a flighted pitching wedge here. The wind up above the trees is actually blowing pretty good. That one looked pretty good right there. If you enjoy these traveling vlogs, drop a like down below and share these videos with your friends. That greatly helps me out and helps me to continue making these videos that hopefully y'all are enjoying. Great club choice and shot selection. We've got about six, seven feet here left for Bert. See if we can't finish this nine strong. That was the best roll of the day right there. And in with the pin slammer here on nine. Finish at one under, a little momentum heading into the back nine in part two. That is it for the front nine from the Pines course here at Seaview. As for me, Seaview, we'll see you when we see you. Peace.